Hey guys, in this tutorial, we will be creating an element that once clicked, slides to a section and opens a tab. So let's get straight into it. Now the first thing we need to do, or rather the first step, is giving some custom IDs. So the first ID will be given to the link block. So in our case, it will be these Facebook accounts. Now, let's give it uh, an ID of Facebook open. And then we need to give the ID to the tab we want to open with that link block. In our case, it will be this Facebook accounts tab. So let's give it a custom ID of Facebook tab. And one last ID we need to assign is of course to the section itself. In our case, this will be the section FB. Let's give it an ID of Facebook. That's step one. It's as simple as that. So the next step, we need a, just a tiny bit of custom code. I already prepared it here, but all you need to do is just copy paste your IDs here. So here we set the link block ID. In our case, it's Facebook open. And down here, we place the ID of the tab, which is Facebook tab. And that's it. So once we save this, we need to do the third step, which is the last one, I promise. We only need to, and it's already done, we only need to give this an URL that will make sure it slides to the Facebook section. In our case, it's like this. Or you can use the native uh, option here, which is this. Now, all we have to do is publish the website and che check if it works. Now, just to test these things out first, you can see that it's currently on the Business Manager tab. So once we click on this, yeah, surely enough, it slides to the section and opens the tab. And that's it, guys. I hope you find this useful. Make sure to, you know, leave some comments for the algorithm. And, you know, I'll see you in the next video.